Listen, I want to share this. I was in church one night, and uh, Pastor Meeks preached a sermon, and the title of the sermon was called Repent. And some of y'all remember that sermon? I was sitting in the back of the church that night, and he said, anybody that wants to be delivered and wants to be set free, he said, I'm about to pray for people. He said, but don't be coming up here playing. If you're not ready to get rid of everything, don't even come up here. So I was sitting in the back of the church, so I said, well, I ain't going up there because I still got some sins I'm planning on doing. <laughs> See, that's why some of y'all can't reach nobody because y'all don't know how to be real. So I was sitting in the back of the church, and then he got toward the end of his sermon, and he said, I need the singers and the musicians. So everybody got off the instruments, and we lined across the front of the church. And... Before I got from where I was standing to the edge of the stage, I was crying and stuff. And I told God, I said, I don't want to be an altar whore. I said, I don't want to have to keep coming up here for my same issues. I don't want to keep coming up here for my same struggles. I don't want to cry and snot and fall out in the floor. And then when I leave, I'm going to pick everything up that I left at the altar. And so... I watched and I looked, I watched Terry, bam. Terry went down, I watched Michael Davis, bam. Michael Davis went down, I watched YL, bam. They was all going down. He was getting closer and closer to me. Then I was really crying in. I was like, Jesus. <laughs> then I watched Nikki, bam. Nikki went down. Then Antonio went down, boom. And I was standing there, I was really crying. And then he said, Malcolm, look at me. And I was like, <laughs> <laughs> And he said, Malcolm, open your eyes and look at me. And I looked up at him. And he said, you're bigger than any struggle that you'll ever deal with. But sometimes it's not enough just to say you repent. I had to tell God I was sorry first. And after I told him I was sorry, I said, please forgive me. Then after that, I said, I repent.
just lift your hands. Sometimes you have to cry out, oh! Sometimes you just don't even want to say the things that you're dealing with. You can just cry out, oh! You know what I said? I said, I want to be right. Anybody want to be right tonight? Say that with me. I want to be right. Come on. I want to be right. When I want to do good, evil is always present. But I say I want to be right. I want to be right. Have you ever said I'm not going to do that thing again and find yourself in the same situation? Somebody just say, I want to be right. Come on, throw your hands up and say, I want to be right.